in this sequence the next sub topic to understand is the functions so first question come what is a function function is a relation or an association between two non empty sets if i say that there is a set a having the elements a b c and this is the set b having the elements 1 2 3 so function is a relation or is an association i am using word relation so i already told you what is a relation relation is the subset of the cartesian product of set with itself or between two sets so function is a relation or an association between two non empty sets here it is very much visible to you that there is a set a a b c and there is another set b which is non empty having the elements 1 2 3 so the best part is here if i tell you that there are three students a is the symbol given to the first one b for second and c for the third there are three students and there are three chairs 1 2 3 first students comes and sit in the on the chair first b sits on chair number 2 and c sits on the chair number 3 one thing again i would like to tell you the function is a relation here is the relation a is related to 1 b is related to 2 c is related to 3 so we can say a comma 1 a is related to 1 b is related to 2 and c is related to 3 so what we can say this relation is a function this is a relation this is the relation because it has the ordered pairs so relation is a function or an association between two non empty sets in such a way that every element of first set is uniquely associated with some element in the second set the definition needs to be explained in very much detail for each word like this function is a relation or an association between two non empty sets in such a way that every element of first set or every element of the set a is uniquely i am using the word uniquely uniquely means each element of first set must have a separate image must have a unique image that's mean if a and b having the same image may possible but it is not possible that only one element may have two images so i am using the word uniquely reason being that function is a relation or an association between two non empty sets in such a way that every element of first set is uniquely associated with some element in the second set if symbolically i told you if it f is the function it is related from a to b so a is the first set b is the second non empty set every element of first set is uniquely associated with some element in the second set now i will explain you few situations where we can say that why the relation is not a set and why the relation is set and what type of the sets are here now i want to create some situation where we need to decide that whether this relation is set or not so first of all i have a set a another i have a set b suppose in the set elements are l m n p and here we have 1 2 3 3 in case if l is associated to 1 m is associated to 2 p is associated to 3 n is not associated with any of the element in the set b but definition of relation is that each element of set 1 must be uniquely associated with some element in set b so this relation expressed here through the diagram 
is not a set because there is no place for the element n which is in the first set in the second set. The element of first set n is not having any image. So it means that this kind of relation or association is not a set because it is not defining, owing, following the definition of the relation, definition of the function. Definition of function is that function is a relation or association such that each element of first set is uniquely associated with some element in the second set. So each element means n is not related here. So that's why this type of relation, this type of the problems are not the function. I can also explain you where you can say this type of problems are also not coming in the function. Suppose if I say there is a set x, this is the another set, suppose you can say y. This set is x, this set is y, this is having the elements a, b, c, d. And here the elements are 1, 2, 3, 4. You can say it is 5 or you can increase one more element like this 6. A is associated with 6. Suppose D is associated with 4. B is associated with 1. And C take the advantage for being associated with the two elements 2 and 3. So it means what? It is also against our definition of the functions. Function is a relation or an association between two non-empty sets in such a way that every element of first set must be uniquely associated with some element in the second set. But here we are finding C is not uniquely associated. C is associated with the two elements, two and three. So it is failing the word uniquely. C is associated is true but not uniquely associated. C is associated with the two elements 2 and 3. Hence, this is also not a function. I can create one more situation where you will find this is a relation but it is not a function. You can see if I am going to take an example is like this. Suppose it is A, B, C, D set X and this is the set y having the elements suppose 1, 2 and 3. 1 is associated with 1, a is associated with 1, b is with 2, c is with 3. Suppose there is no association for d. It means what? It means that the, it is also not following the definition of the functions because each element of first set here d is left out. d is not associated with any element in the second set. Hence, this is also a situation where this is not a function. So, for function, there must be two non-empty set in such a way that every element of set 1 must be uniquely associated with some element in the set 2 or second set.